In 2017, there were almost 1,800 people killed on UK roads. But there's technology being fitted to cars now that could make that crash a thing of the past. It's called AEB, Autonomous Emergency Braking, and it's fitted to many, many cars. It uses a radar and a camera to sense a collision is going to occur. Warn the driver to brake, and if the driver doesn't brake, automatically put the brakes on to avoid the crash. It's an integral part of the Euro NCAP five star rating. In fact, if you haven't got AEB, you don't get five stars. And the test is done on a test track. Now we can't use cardboard boxes or even a real car for safety reasons. This target's been specifically designed to replicate a real car. It's soft, so it can be hit, but it's got the right visual characteristics like a back window and a license plate. It's also got the right radar characteristics for the radar because you want the car to stop when it has to and not stop if it doesn't need to. There are 500 pedestrians killed on UK roads every year. That's 10 a week, but AEB can stop that too. AB for pedestrians uses the very same sensors, namely a radar and a camera. And Euro NCAP test both adults and children, and they also test in darkness to make sure that the systems are as robust as they possibly can be. The dummies we use in pedestrian testing are just as complex as the car target. They have to be as human-like as possible and they also have to move. They have to have moving legs and arms. You don't want your car to stop for a piece of paper blowing across the road and so a cardboard cutout just won't work. We're all being encouraged to cycle more to keep fit, but with that comes a hundred or so cyclists killed every year on UK roads. But AEB can help prevent those accidents occurring. AEB is fitted to almost all brands of vehicle. It works for traffic, it works for pedestrians and it works for cyclists. In fact, AB is already reducing crashes by about 38%. So when you're in the market for a new car, make sure it's fitted with autonomous emergency braking. It'll save lives.